sorry, Jerry. But I do hope that very soon you forget all about me and you find a beautiful, loving woman that you just fall madly in love with. That's a problem. I already did. I'm not sure if you're going to believe this, but it's going to take me to get over you too. Good. <laughs> you don't know what you're missing. Look, you got to be careful. Len and Rebecca know about the secret. I know, but uh, she promised not to tell Ethan. You believe her? You actually trust her to keep her mouth shut? Up until tonight, I would have thought no, but now, yeah, I think I can. I'm glad that there's a new man in your life. All I've ever wanted for you is to be happy. I'm dying to meet him. So when do we find out who this new mystery man is? Mother, stop it. I don't want to jinx it, okay? Okay, fine, fine. I don't want to be the one to jinx your newfound happiness. I don't either. I don't either. You uh, deserve a great guy. You definitely do. But I still want you to be a part of Jane's life, Glenn. Okay, you're like a second mother to her, and I really want it to stay that way. Well, thank you. But I don't know where I'm going to be living. It's definitely not going to be Harmony. Okay, but don't go too far away. Because I want you to feel free to come by and see her whenever you want. She needs you, all right? Thank you. Look who's here. Oh! What's up? Where are you going? When a couple gets a divorce, usually the guy moves out. It's uh, time for me to get going, so... That's something we agree on. Ethan? Sorry. Sorry. And done. Uh, we were just leaving. No, we weren't. Yes, we were. Glenn, wait, wait. I just want you to know I'm serious about Jane, okay? You can see her whenever you want. Thank you. Good night. We said I can't keep her away from Jane. Doesn't seem right at all. Well, I think Gwen has the right idea. I should um, I should be going too. Thank you again, Jared. Why are you giving me the bums rush, huh? The taco queen needs to pay for what she's done. Yes, she does. Don't rush it. All in good time. <laughs> 